Nigerian President Muhammadu Buhari said on Friday that a wave of deadly violence against Nigerians and other foreign nationals in South Africa last month was an embarrassment to the continent. In September, rioting and attacks on foreign, uh, foreigners rather led to at least 10 deaths, dozens of injuries and hundreds of arrests, triggering anger at home and abroad. Buhari told a town hall meeting with Nigerians living in South Africa that the acts of xenophobic attacks on our compatriots and other Africans in South Africa were shocking to him, Nigerians, and indeed Africa. Buhari met South African President Cyril Ramaphosa on Thursday. They, were bo they both regretted the violence and subsequent retaliation in Nigeria against South African businesses, pledging instead to deepen trade ties. Buhari called for peace at the town hall meeting. Um, I think Nigerians know the stand of the leadership that when you are in Rome, you do what the Romans do. When you are in a country, you study the people and the laws and you get yourself uh, in line with what the authorities and the people accept there. If you do anything outside, uh, the people's understanding and agreement, they will not, eventually, they will not accept it. This is a very well-known thing, and um, uh, we discussed this, thing, as I said, in depth with the, with the president, and uh, I told him the example of Ghana, from trading in cola nuts to slave trade to uh, now modern trade, industries, and so on, and the competition with the growth of population in all countries. Meanwhile, the president of Nigeria, Muhammadu Buhari, has been condemned by the Human Rights Writers Association of Nigeria for visiting South Africa over recent xenophobic attacks. Huriwa, in a statement issued on Friday, said President Buhari's visit is disgraceful and has exposed Nigeria to international ridicule, thereby cheapening the rate of the country before the eyes of the world. The group, in a statement signed by its national coordinator, Emmanuel Omubiko, also condemned the locks lackluster approach of the federal government towards the persistent xenophobic killings of Nigerians by, by black South Africans in the former apartheid enclave. The group stated that the president couldn't have gone on this visit but would have explored the African Union and the United Nations to arrive at concrete actions to end xenophobic violence in South Africa instead of visiting the same place whereby hundreds of citizens were displaced and many killed as if the victims of such a devastating crimes are now supposed to beg the aggressors. Kuriwa also accused the media minders of the presidency and the foreign affairs ministry of not being economical with the truth and speaking from both sides of the mouth over the matter.